All right, this is the finished product. <laughs> and anyone who gardens knows that you never know from year to year what something's going to do. And it can do great one year, and then the next year I do absolutely nothing. But if the past two years are any indicator how these impatiens will grow in this water, um, it should be pretty cool to see in a couple weeks. Hey, this is week two of the pond impatiens, the impatiens that we planted in the pond filters. Hey, this is week three of the impatiens. Hey, I believe this is week five of our impatience, and they're really starting to look pretty now. This is either week six or week seven of the impatience. I can't remember which, and this is what I remember them doing from last year. Just huge and beautiful and gorgeous. And um, this will probably be the last time I film them because this is about as big as they get, but aren't they huge and pretty? And that fish water is just good, good food for them, and they're helping to clean the water for the fish, so wonderful little flower fish relationship there. These are the ones that we planted in the soil at the front of the pond. And they're pretty. I mean, they're doing well, but they're nothing like those. I mean, that is one white impatien in each of those front baskets. It's only one. This is one white impatien planted in soil. So, you can you can see the difference <laughs> only one plant up there in that whole bucket one white there's one white and one pink i'll have to look back and see if there was something else but i know there's only one white and they've just gone crazy they're absolutely gorgeous and huge all right thanks for watching